Morning and Break with Ann and Audra. We are here at the lovely L Market in the Market District, right? Yes, and we love it here. It's beautiful. So beautiful. I feel like we should serve everyone. What do you need? What fashion well, insider I had, tips I was, do you need? I was served a bellini earlier, and it was delicious. I need to get a donut. I feel like I haven't checked that off yet. I need to get oh, a donut. They always have goodies here. I goodies do. to eat, goodies to wear, goodies to kind of experience. Well, you can eat a donut because we have Josh Cooper on the show, and he's going to make us something healthy. Yes. And so oh, we'll balance. About, it's all about balance. Yes, 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 yes can, he's making okay. something delicious. And then, work, and, and what about working out? And then we're, we're working about out. We've got Pure Bar on the show. So yes, oh, you need to have that donut. Okay. You need to treat I need yourself. To. It is mm -hmm. a wonderful thing. But on the show, as yes. we just covered, we've got Pure Bar. Okay. We've got Josh Cooper, who is a reality TV chef. <gasps> Master and star. chef. That's right. right. And then we're going to talk to some top singles. Uh, we're going to talk about Best of Tallahassee cool. with Tallahassee Magazine. We've got a whole bunch of stuff good. that's packed in the show. Sounds good. So we're just going to get excited. Started. Are you ready? Let's do it. Let's do it. Filming live in Tallahassee each and every week, you can imagine I've seen just about every business in town. I've seen the good, the bad, and the ugly. But one business stands out above the rest and you see their cars everywhere. Where you ask? Right here at Kraft Nissan. I got my last three cars here and I'll get my next three cars here. It's no wonder that Tallahassee is a Nissan town. These guys make me feel super. I love that. North Florida Women's Care offers the highest quality services for obstetrical and gynecological patients. We are a group practice of caring, industry-leading providers. We have the highest quality ultrasound equipment in Tallahassee. You can call or reach us online 24-7 at the patient portal for appointments, test results, billing, or to send a secure message to our nursing staff. North Florida Women's Care delivers the care you deserve and the trust you expect. Welcome back to A.M. Rake. We are here with somebody who's going to feed us. Yay! Love some food. Love some food. All right, so this is Josh Cooper. Tell us about yourself. My name is Josh Cooper. I'm a political consultant here in town. Um, a couple, about a year ago, I went down to Orlando and um, sat down with about 3,000 of my closest friends and right. tried out for a television show called MasterChef. And <laughs> Out of the forty thousand people nationwide, they uh, they selected. let me they let me come on to the show. So. Selected you, but how many people were selected to be on this particular uh, run of the show? So right now, it's it's the top forty uh, home chefs in the country, and there's we're battling for a white apron, which will break it down to twenty. So perfect. Okay, so a little bit about <clears throat> the show, Master Chef. It airs on Fox. What day? What time? Uh, Fox on Wednesday nights at eight p.m. Eastern. Um, and so that's right here. With a box. real deal of like reality stuff. I know, it's a reality stuff. <laughs> oh, so God, sorry. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. We're going to go ahead and let you cook. And then we're also going to ask you some questions about what it's like to be your reality TV star. Because you know you've got a lot of people who constantly send out those tapes. They want to get on Survivor or whatever show it may be. So Survivor. Let's talk about your experience of being on the reality TV show. Yeah, I mean, you know, a lot of people want the exposure to try to, you know, get on television. Uh, for me, I, I love the television show. Master Chef was my favorite show. I love to cook. I would watch it and I'd say, I think I could do better than that guy. Right? I can do better than him. Well, I did. Sure. Uh, and so, you know, I went, like I said, I went down, uh, all these folks, 3,000 or so people went down to Orlando, waited in line for a chance to show the judges their food, um, try to make it on the show. And, you know, it, you just had to be yourself. You just had to be uh, very loud and, and uh, a little obnoxious. Sure. Uh, set yourself apart, uh, which I'm pretty good at doing. Um, so I went down there. Yeah, I went out there and just, you know, was excited, gave them my personality, showed them, you know, my love for food. Um, talked about my inspiration for food, which is my kids, and how that, you know they've they've led me to, to want to use organic um, ingredients and really learn how to cook so that they would eat better. Uh, and just kind of told my story, and one thing led to another, and it went brought me out to L.A. Sure. to film the make show. So. And now you're a reality TV. Yeah, make it happen, just oh, like Roger said. Going to L.A. to get on Hollywood. Okay. All right, so let's take a just a quick second. What are you making for us today? Because of course we're going to have you cooking for us. Sure. Well, it's summertime, right? So we're going to have you know grill outs, cookouts, and everybody you know makes their hot dogs and hamburgers. But 
I like to take it a little bit different. I like to kind of go to the next level, if you will. So what I'm doing is a watermelon salad. It's going to have some red onion, some mint, some balsamic vinegar, goat cheese, and a little flake uh, crystal right. salt. So Well, the only thing Audra and I have eaten all day is a donut, so a donut. this is probably a good National. thing. Yeah. Probably a good thing for us. Knowing that you're a master chef, I mean, are people counting on you all the time like, hey, come <laughs> over, cook this, do this. I mean, you're the master. Why don't you help us out? <laughs> well, yeah, you know, I mean, I, I've been cooking competitive barbecue for 10 years, and um, our team, you know, just recently competed in the World Barbecue Championships down in Memphis in May, and we actually won first place in the exotic Congrats. category, first time world champions for that. So, you know, my friends do know that I can grill and like to cook out and, mm. and, and throw good parties. So, yeah, certainly get invited to uh, to, to man the grill at, at their house. <laughs> That makes a lot of sense. We'll, we'll know who we're inviting next when we to the, the next event. All right, so wonderful. So in terms of the show, I know that you guys have a very uh, mm -hmm. strict, no spoiler alert rule. <laughs> That's right. Um, any little tidbits that you can tell us in terms of what we'll be seeing on the next episode? Sure. Well, the next episode, you'll, you'll be seeing me competing for my white apron, hopefully. Um, I'll be cooking my signature dish on the show, which is going to be veal parmesan. Um, and, you know, I, we'll just have to see how it plays out, but... Um, you know, I think I put, put together a pretty good dish, and we'll see how the judges uh, reacted to it. All right, perfect. So, again, this is Josh Cooper. He is one of our master chefs on the reality TV show that airs on Fox every Wednesday night at what time? 8 p.m. So make sure uh, you just missed it last night, so check it out in about six days or so, and we will continue to follow and see how Josh does. And we're going to go ahead and let you stay here and keep um, working this up, and then we're going to come back and check in with you and eat some more. Sounds good. All Thanks. Right, perfect. We'll be right back. Whether you're building a new home or remodeling your current home, at Brian Barnard's Flooring America, we can help you achieve the look you want at the prices the box stores can't compete with. For hardwood, carpet, tile, and rugs, for any area in your home, we'll take your design ideas and turn them into reality. From all the floors in your home to the walls in the kitchen and bath, we have the right products at the right price with exceptional service and installation. Brian Barnard's Flooring America, where friends send friends. And break with Anna and Audra. I am really happy to be with some old friends. I feel like you're old friends because yes. uh, we have some lovely ladies here representing Pure Bar and I'm gonna let you introduce yourselves and tell our viewers at home a little bit about what the awesome experience is that is Pure Bar. So I'm Lena Shields and I'm the manager of the Tallahassee North location. My name is Jillian Mormon and I am the manager of the Pure Bar Tallahassee South location. So Pure Bar is a low impact, high intensity workout, mm -hmm. 55 minute minutes, full body workout. It is a fusion of yoga, Pilates, and ballet. So it's not necessarily similar to any of those. Mm -hmm. It's the benefits of all three of those combined into our own recipe oh to make a fabulous workout. Listen, I love it. I'm a <laughs> runner and like, you know, yoga is like on one end of the spectrum and running is another one, but you guys do something. I'm like, oh, I didn't know I had this muscle. I didn't know that was there. So yes, it's a great cross training for running. It actually links increases your flexibility, totally. which also lengthens your stride and gets you better PR yes. times. Okay, so it's five yes. And I gotta say, the plank, the core work, I mean, oh, that's the best core like, work you'll you find. Need Spanish, for sure. You just need pure bar. <laughs> yeah. All right, so tell people, you know, what are some things to expect? They go in, I mean, any specials that you have, you know, they're like, I've never tried it, I wanna try it, what do I do, how do I get involved? Well, we actually just launched a first week free. So we're just really confident that people that come in the doors, they're gonna love it, they're gonna mm -hmm. fall in love with the technique like we have. Um, so we offer that first week on us and mm -hmm. then 
if you take three classes throughout that first free week, then you can get $15 off your intro okay, month. So yeah, so you get 30 days of unlimited classes, normally for $99, we'll take $15 off of that. So we like to reward clients for like coming in and mm -hmm. like dedicating their time to it and like give them some reward for it. I gotta say, every time I went, there was always motivation. You always had a kind of challenge or try to get to this bar, or this many classes. I'm like, okay, I have to do this. You know, even if it's just for my mental, like I checked this off, I did it. Um, and another thing that's great, I think is that with this workout, people check out. You know, a lot of times, you know, you run, you get distracted, you got your phone, whatever. I mean, this really is a workout dedicated to mind, body, soul, getting yourself together. You have to focus so hard on what you're doing and you're not focused on what anyone else is doing, not right. concerned about the person next to you, and you can leave everything outside the door. And that's what most of the women come in looking for. They want an outlet. They want the stress relief from whether it be, you know, you know, kids at home mm -hmm. and all the to and from, or my mommy's time. nine to five, yeah, <laughs> right. and they need that, you know, but right. they have to take care of themselves in order to take care of everybody else. So. And so what about people who's like, you know, I've just never done bar or yoga, I don't know, I'm a very much a beginner. What can they expect? How can we, how can they get integrated into the whole pure bar system? We have a class called Pure Foundations. Okay. We just launched that, so it's really exciting for us. But it's kind of an intro class. Mm -hmm. um, some people just jump, jump oh, on I in. You, I you did. Know? I'm like, yeah. let's go. Let's some go. people okay. like to jump on in. They just go for it. But some people, you know, it just depends on how you want to take it. But we do offer Pure Foundations at both locations. Okay, it sounds good. So um, how do people get in contact with you? You can visit our website, it's purebar.com, and you can search for the Tallahassee North or Tallahassee South Studio. Um, or you can follow us on Facebook and Instagram. Um, we kind of have two different sites for both, so it's kind of, okay, you know, gotcha. but um, just Google Pure Bar Tallahassee and you'll find us and you'll be able to like, sign up for classes online. You can book okay. everything there. We have a great Pure Bar um, mobile app that's really user friendly too. Love it. Okay. Well, yeah. Ann and I are going to be coming to Lift, Tuck, and Burn, right? Is that what we yeah. do? Lift, Tuck, yeah. and Burn. Yeah. And we'll be there and show you viewers at home what to expect walking into class. So thank you so much for joining thank us today. Thanks for thank having you. us. Yeah. Stick around. We'll be right back. Every morning, the sun rises on our fair city. A while later, Chris, the late riser, wakens for a day of work and involvement in FSU and community, serving Tallahassee as he has for years. Across town, Brother Peter, the early riser, has already turned on the lights, checked itineraries, and game-planned with loyal employees who've been showing up every day for decades. And as the day rolls into business mode, the brothers orchestrate what has come to be recognized as Tallahassee's premier auto dealership. Your car dealer, Kraft Nissan. Whether you're building a new home or remodeling your current home, at Brian Barnard's Flooring America, we can help you achieve the look you want at the prices the box stores can't compete with. For hardwood, carpet, tile, and rugs, for any area in your home, we'll take your design ideas and turn them into reality. From all the floors in your home to the walls in the kitchen and bath, we have the right products at the right price with exceptional service and installation. Brian Barnard's Flooring America, where friends send friends. North Florida Women's Care offers the highest quality services for obstetrical and gynecological patients. We are a group practice of caring, industry-leading providers. We have the highest quality ultrasound equipment in Tallahassee. You can call or reach us online 24-7 at the patient portal for appointments, test results, billing, or to send a secure message to our nursing staff. North Florida Women's Care delivers the care you deserve and the trust you expect. Welcome back to AM Break with Ann and Audra. We're here at El Market. It's a little loud. We've got some ladies shopping, but that's okay. Mackenzie and I can, can deal with that. <laughs> Joining me from Tallahassee Magazine, Roland Publishing, is Kenzie Lubeck. Nailed it. First time, girl. I got your name down. <laughs> I got your name down. And why are you here with us today? What are we talking about? So we're talking about Best of Tallahassee. Yes, this uh, Best of Reader's Choice poll that launched back in 1999. Yes, so you know, before I was at Roland Publishing, but it is it's hard to remember definitely a very popular yeah. wanted vote in town, and we love putting it on every year. Yeah, it's awesome. I mean, it is an honor to be voted on and selected for that, and basically the way that it works is how? How do people vote? So basically how it works is the May-June issue of Tallahassee Magazine has an actual ballot in it. Right. So there's about 100 categories, and you have to actually just you hand write in whatever businesses you want for the various sure. categories and you mail it in to we have a um, Thomas Howell Ferguson right. does our official ballot county so it doesn't even go to you guys you guys never we don't ever it. see any right. of them Perfect. correct mm -hmm. so we stay out of it it's very specific and important and we want to make sure that we hire a firm that can really be known for their right. audit yes so 
Um, voting goes through June 16th. So you have to have the envelope, uh, envelope marked by June 16th. And they count it and they give us the results. So there's no online option? We do have five online categories, just for fun to kind of get some of the millennials involved, sure. which surprisingly, they actually do a lot of the hard ballot voting as well. Right. Um, so you can vote school, online. Very traditional. Yes. <laughs> it is. It's just like you know, voting for the president. Right. You know, you got to go in, you got to show person. up, you got to fill it out, right. and it gets submitted, and um, we get the results of the top two businesses. So we don't even know out of the top two who won first and second. Sure. All we get from Thomas Hal Ferguson is who's the top two. Okay. We then invite them to the event, and it's open to the public, which comes up in October. And that night is unveiled of who got first and second. Right. But it's just a big celebration. It's amazing. It's uh -huh. a lot of fun. I've been to quite a few of the Best of Tallahassee's. As a matter of fact, the first time Audra ever did any reporting yes. <laughs> was at a Best of Tallahassee. And they just kind of kicked her out to the, the crowd and made her do it. And she did great. She was awesome. So it is a very fun event. Is there anything specific that you want folks to know other than the voting process any, and the fact that they're counted not by Tallahassee Magazine? Anything else important to know? I would just say, you know, Tallahassee Magazine, we're actually celebrating our 38th year this yeah, year, which right. is really amazing. Um, we do have the printed ballot in the magazine, and um, we do print about 20,000 copies of the magazine. And what I would just like people to know is of that, there's about 15,000 that are direct mailed into homes locally here. Sure. So it is truly majority our readership who's voting. There are magazines for sale at Barnes & Noble, Books A Million, and Roland Publishing. Um, but it's primarily our readership mm -hmm. for the amount of people that vote. So that's something that's just really unique to keep it local to the people who live here. Right. You know, some of the things online are fun, but anybody could vote. Sure. So it's fun to just see who lives in Tallahassee, who they think is the best. And that's really what Tallahassee Magazine's right. Best of Tallahassee is all about. And then also, the ballots are still counted. Let's say that somebody gets their ballot and they only vote for 17 categories. Obviously, that's counted still. It's not held against them that they didn't vote in every category. As long as you fill out 10 categories or more, it's counted. Perfect. Okay, yeah. wonderful. Well, yeah. then we are so excited to see who wins Best of Tallahassee. Of course, we'll be there at the event, which is yes. when? It's Well, we're still working out dates. It's probably okay. November 1st is okay. when we're looking at doing it. So we're I really remember excited. it as being the first chilly event of the year that I yes. really get excited about. <laughs> so, so it's typically in that time of year. Well, wonderful. We're looking forward to that. Make sure you get your ballot out. Again, if you want to vote and get a ballot, Barnes & Noble, Roland Publishing, and where else? And Books A Million. Books A Million. You can get your magazine there so you can fill out your ballot. Thank you for joining us. Thank you. We'll and be best of luck. Best of luck. We'll be right back. <laughs> Back on the air, we're at the best of Tallahassee, and we're with one of the best in Tallahassee. They're starting to give out awards. This guy's up tonight, Russell Dawes. Everybody's favorite place is the Tallahassee Museum. We're there all the time. How much fun is it to be here with all your peers? It is. There's so many great businesses here tonight. This is what makes community great. I agree. If you saw the show last week, we were there for the big Halloween howl. It was a great episode. And now, Russell, this week, we got the next big event, Zubilee. We do, Zubilee. It's like the best adult fun fundraiser in Tallahassee. Be there. And what makes it so much fun? 20 restaurants, open bar. What? What? Five beer taps, all for a single ticket. All right. We don't nickel and dime you. Really? Yeah, and one of the best bands in the area, Tobacco Road. They are good. They are. All right, I've just made an executive decision. Live in Tallahassee will be there next week. So we'll be there. We'll see you. Fantastic. Come check them out. Jubilee, Tallahassee Museum. from First Commerce Credit Union and Six Pillars Financial Advisors, and we are so excited to be the best of Tallahassee right. once again. All right. What do you guys have to say to people of Tallahassee about your win tonight? We say thank you, Tallahassee. We love you. I heart Tally. Thank you for voting us the best again. Hi, Brittany Dean, owner of Harper Hill Kids Boutique. Thank you, Tallahassee, for voting, voting us best children's clothing boutique. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We represent Springtime Tallahassee. I'm Karen J the current general chair. This is... I'm Steve Lestowski, I'm the president. Tim Jansen, I'm Andrew Jackson. And we invite all of y'all to come out April 1st, 2017 for our 49th festival. 
Awesome, all right, in the middle of it all now, the awards are going fast here, and we are thrilled to announce Best Hotel in the winner's area. Here she is, Pam Bauer. Here representing the Doubletree by Hilton, downtown Tallahassee, Best Hotel. I mean, unbelievable, the things that you've done with that hotel, it's a beautiful place. Talk about some of the exciting things happening over there. Joel, it's amazing. If you have not been downtown to see the transformation of the Doubletree, you must make the effort. We all know that the Doubletree is the heart of downtown, but now with yes. this multi-million dollar head-to-toe renovation, uh, it, is, it is a showstopper. It puts the capital city in an elevated light. Um, everyone visiting will understand that Tallahassee is not messing around. Right, yes. unbelievable. We are the capital of hospitality, I mean, y'all. It's, it's a great centerpiece of our downtown. Absolutely. And it's a great place to stay if you got relatives in town, right? That's it. If you've got relatives in town, if you want to impress clients, you're recruiting someone new for your business, there's the only place to stay is the Doubletree. Doubletree by Hilton, newly renovated. Best Let's hotel. Check them out. And, you know, let me just say, yes. we will soon be winning Best Bar and Lounge when the rooftop is complete. I'll just leave it at that. I want to I want to do that story. Yes. <laughs> You'll be there. <laughs> Thanks live in Tallahassee. Welcome back to AM Break with Ann and Audra. I am so proud to have some more Tallahassee Magazine Top Singles, the 2017 crew. So ladies, I'm going to let you introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about the charity that you're supporting with this cause. My name is Shine Jones and I chose Girls to Divas. They do one-on-one -on -one mentoring and different workshops. And they provide the tools and resources for young girls to develop into successful, driven young women. That's good. Um, I'm Katherine Palmer. I work for Marshall Models in town. My charity is American Cancer Society. Um, so you, I'm sure everyone's very familiar with them. I'm directing my fundraising towards Relay for Life. So it's benefiting research and treatment for patients all over the nation. Wow. Now this is a very exciting endeavor. Tallahassee Magazine Top Singles is a fun event. It's not just the main event, which is on July 29th, 7 p.m. at the Civic Center, but there are a lot of little events leading up to it. So tell us about any plans that you have, anything you want to do to kind of get out in the community, let people get to know you a little bit, or some things that you have planned? Um, well, I do have one fundraiser planned. I run Queen of Hearts Fitness, so we're putting oh, on... Oh, I'm excited about that. <laughs> <laughs> right. yeah. so, cool. so it's actually our three-year anniversary this June. So on June 29th, we're hosting a Queens of the Jungle show Ooh. at Fifth and Thomas. Mm -hmm. Doors are at 7 p.m., so all that is going to go towards Girls to Divas. Sounds awesome. Cool. And anything planned? Anything you're thinking about? Haven't planned anything yet, but I will have something fun for you guys, hopefully soon, and um, we'll... And we'll check it out on we'll Facebook. We'll stay updated. There are so many of y'all that, every, and I think everyone's very supportive. I mean, it's a competitive, but everyone it's likes to support everybody. Exactly, exactly. So, um, anything else that you want to tell the viewers at home about yourself, what you're looking forward to, anything about this event, and anything coming up? You just, just ready to go. I'm We're really just ready to go. go. Okay. This is my first year being a top single, so I don't even really know what to expect. Oh yeah, you don't. But you know what? We're gonna show some footage from past shows, and you'll kind of get the idea for it. But it's really fun. It's a big old party. And you get to run down the runway and not by yourself. I'm not, not trying to scare you. I think I need to stop talking. So for those of you at home who are interested, go to TallahasseeMagazine.com. Tickets are on sale. The big event is Saturday, July 29th at 7 p.m. Get your tickets now. They're going fast. And support these top singles. Thank you, ladies, for joining us. Stick around. We'll be right back. Welcome back to AM Break. I have two wonderful, fantastic top singles with us right now. Let me have you guys introduce yourselves. My name is Jessica Fowler. And my name is Todd Koontz. Perfect. And as you know, we had some folks on last week and we're talking about top singles 2017, which is an opportunity for everyone to get together and bid on the most wonderful top singles in all of Tallahassee. So tell me about your charity and why you selected it. Um, my charity is MAD, Mothers Against Drunk Driving. Um, my father was in a wreck um, and it was caused by a drunk driver. I read your story, that's amazing. Yeah. yeah. So, so obviously very, very, very near, near and dear. Near and dear, yes, to my heart. And you chose your and charity? I chose the American Heart Association. Um, it's the number one killer in America, especially in a town like Tallahassee, where we have a university that receives funding um, for research and 
it's really just something that everyone can get behind. I've never met a person that wasn't affected by it in the first place in one sure. way or another. Absolutely. I mean, it's definitely an issue for my family, heart disease and things like that. So uh, obviously an, another really amazing charity. So what are you guys most excited about now as you are officially top singles and working up to the big day, which is July 29th at 6 p.m. at the Civic Center? Most excited about raising money. I'm a little bit nervous about walking the stage, though. Sure, so we'll absolutely. See how that goes. Yeah, <laughs> and, and if you've never worked on raising money for a charity, it's actually a little bit of a tricky thing to learn how to do, and you, yes. you want to do well and have a good showing for your charity. What are you most excited about? Um, I don't even really know yet, right. honestly. Um, I'm just excited for the whole thing, sure, especially when that. I guess when that magazine comes out is, I guess when it all kind of becomes a real thing. That is a lot of fun, actually, though. So you should be looking forward to that. It's mm -hmm. just fun to be spotlighted just a little bit and all for a very, very good cause. Is there anything that you want people at home to know in terms of some of your fundraising events that you may be having as we work up to July 29th? Um, I'm partnering with Pure Bar June 24th. We actually have um, another show in just a little bit. Yes! Yay! Yay! Pure Bar! Pure Bar. Um, so that'll happen. Uh, I have a couple other things in place, but nothing set in stone yet, so stay tuned. Stay tuned. <laughs> I'm way behind her. I, <laughs> right. It's I, a, it's, it's I a haven't set show. up anything yet, but um, I figure I have till July 29th. So like July 1st, I'll be blowing up all your Facebooks and all that. And, that is um, not a problem. Just I'll make sure you get that going. link out there exactly. and, and go in and send it out. <laughs> Just that alone, you're going to get some donations. So that's always a lot of fun and very, very good. All right, well, wonderful. Congratulations to the two of you for being selected for such a great honor. We hope that you do very well. We will be there at the event July 29th at the Civic Center. In the meantime, you need to get your tickets. There are down to just a few tables left, so that means we're going to have a lot of people there already. No pressure, no yeah, pressure. There's none. more people to possibly bid on you. It's a good thing. <laughs> and we will see you on July 29th and you July 29th at the Civic Center. We'll be right back after this. Hi, I'm Dr. Chris Sunstrom of North Florida Women's Care with today's Healthy Hint. Did you know that folic acid is a B vitamin that every cell in your body needs for normal growth and development? It helps your body make red blood cells that carry oxygen from your lungs to all parts of your body. Taking folic acid before and during early pregnancy can help prevent birth defects of a baby's brain and spine. Some studies show that it also may help prevent heart defects and birth defects in a baby's mouth called cleft lip and palate. Because many birth defects develop within the first month of pregnancy, it's wise for all women to take a multivitamin with folic acid. Three months before conception and throughout your pregnancy, take a multivitamin containing at least 400 micrograms of folic acid. Taking multivitamins with folic acid is important because it is difficult to get all the folic acid you need from food alone. Excellent sources of folic acid are leafy greens like spinach and romaine lettuce, broccoli, citrus, fruits, and beans. Also, look for the word fortified or enriched on food package labels. Food enriched or fortified with added folic acid often include breads, pastas, white rice, and tortillas. Drop this healthy hint to family and friends from Dr. Chris Sundstrom at North Florida Women's Care. We don't have a lot of time to talk, so we're just going to close it out. Close it out. Wasn't close that fun? It, it was fun. It's fun. And Mar so much fun, I don't remember what we have coming on the show next week, but it'll be fun too. I'm fun. It's what we do. It's yeah. probably some alcohol and some food involved. <laughs> <laughs> and that's why we have fun. <laughs> All right, Tallahassee, we will see you next week. Salute. 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 Go, and Go. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. What do you think? <laughs>